I'm Michael Rose and I'm on Reggae TV. Stay tuned. Hey, I'm me if I tell you. I won't. <laughs> yeah. My father wrote the song called Children Pain in the Street, 1979. By that time, he had built his studio. But we just get put into that studio and started singing that song. So, my name is Itana. It means the strong one from Swahili. And I chose the strong one because I think all women are beautiful all over the world. When I was a young kid growing up and people would talk about their music in class, I would be talking about Peter Tosh and these things and kids would make fun of me for listening to the music. But for some reason it really spoke to me. Yeah, we done Reggae Sun Splash and that was huge. You know, Jamaica is one of the hardest places to perform. And especially if you're coming from the UK, they don't really know about us and know us too much. This is Papa Michigan and you're watching Reggae TV and we're speaking to the great Lee Scratch Perry. Well, so Perry. One love Papa Michigan and continue the good work. I've listened to a ton of reggae and so that comes out in the music and so it's, it's cool to be able to be on a show like this to kind of pay tribute to talk about how important that was in my musical development. We were Bob's three little birds. We went in, all three of us, and we did Natty Dread. And Natty Dread was a number one song. Boop. The rest is history. But when I see Rolling Stone them and pick up on a track of mine, I was like, oh, our people have been picking me up from afar. No, well, you know, Rasta can't tired. Rasta never tired. We never get weary at no time. You know, and we'll be playing the music forever because, you know, the people cannot do without the music. What do we do without music? We don't know. We, do, we, have, a, we have a boring world. <laughs>